This is not food. Hello everyone! I hope you're having a great spooky day. So today's Vlogoween is a haul of sorts. I guess it's a haul. Yeah, it's a haul. <laughs> I did some Halloween shopping and I'm excited to show you what I got for the trick-or-treaters, myself, and just the family around here. Let's get into it. So what I'll start off with first is the candy to get that out of the way. And I bought the most ginormous bag of candy in the world. Look at that. A little money on it. So it has sweet tart, fluffy taffies, nerds, and bottle caps. All sorts of great Wonka candies. Oh, the back. Can you hear me back here? Did you hear me say that we have sweet tarts, fluffy taffies, nerds, and bottle caps? Wonka candy. And it has the serving portion in the back. It says thoughtful portion. Four sweet tart packs equals 50 calories. Really well. Wow. Um, two Laffy Taffy bars equals 75 calorie calories. One Nerds box is 45 calories. And four bottle cap packs is 50 calories. So just because they're low in calories does not mean to stuff your face. Just kidding, stuff your face. And the packets are kind of small, but I think they'll go a long way. This has 450 pieces in it. And I got this at Target. Target's the place to be for candy. Most definitely. The next candy bag is chocolate. And this one I actually got at Walmart. And it's 240 pieces. And this one is Milky Way, Twix, Three Musketeers, Snickers, and Milky Way Midnight. Which is one of my favorite candy bars. I prefer Milky Way Midnight over regular Milky Way. Next bag of candy that I got at Target. It's gonna be a lot of loud crinkling. I apologize. I will try my best to adjust the sound as much as I can to my abilities. Um, this one has a little werewolf on it. He's so cute. Oh, It has Crunch Bar, Butterfinger, Baby Roos. And I don't like Baby Roos, but my mom does. This is more for her to take stuff to work. And this is 200 pieces. So, so at my Target, they're having a sale of like buy one bag, get another bag 50% off. And it depends, of course, on the ounces of bags. It was like 48 ounces to 102 ounces that you get the half off bag. So I got that giant bag of Wonka stuff for, I think that was 23. And then this bag was originally like 15 and I got it for like $8. We're not done with candy yet. There's more. Twizzlers are one of my favorite things to get on Halloween. Like when I was a trick-or-treater, even now when like teachers would give out these candies. Um, especially these twist ones because they're not the cherry. The cherry ones, me personally, I don't think they're that great. But the regular flavored um, Twizzlers with the twist, I love these. I don't know why they taste a little bit I don't know, they just taste better than regular Twizzlers, and the texture is better. They're not hard, they're kind of soft. These are bomb. Next, candy. And these are more for the house. Some of these are going to be for the house, but these next two are specifically for the house. We have these Harvest M&Ms with the peanut in it. Uh, my mom really likes the peanut ones, so that's what we got. And they come in little fun Harvest colors. And then everybody's favorite, candy corn. I have no shame in saying that I love candy corn. I love it. And this one's a variety pack of the regular candy corn, the pumpkin shapes, and the chocolate candy corn. Mm. My teeth are going to be on fire. <laughs> on with some other kind of treats. So I bought some treat bags to give out to trick-or-treaters. And these are at Walmart for 98 cents. And we have these cute little skeleton trick-or-treaters. Look at him. Hi. <laughs> He's 
so cute. I think all of them come in a pack of 20. Yeah, all of them come in a pack of 20. Um, next we have this little witch on her broom with her little candy pail. And then these really fun happy jack-o'-lanterns. So cute. At Walmart, I got these little, like, bouncy balls. I really like bouncy balls. I collect them, so I'm definitely going to keep one of these. I just have this I just have to decide which one I'm going to keep. This wore a dollar ninety eight. You say it on the tag here. And very cute. I think trick or treaters would really love that. And then I found these it says sticky stuff. And they're like little Halloween stickies. It has six in there. It's like those little like little hand slappy sticky things. So I got some of those to gift out to the trick-or-treaters and I think they're going to love these. I used to have the hand sticky thing and I would play with it all the time. So I really hope that they play with these and annoy their siblings if they have any. I found some great noisemakers for kids to annoy the heck out of their parents. And they are these little like vampire fang noisemakers that are so cute. I kind of want to keep one of these too, but I won't. Maybe. We'll see. And another noisemaker that I have, these little Halloween recorder looking flutes that are just going to make a ton of noise. And I don't know, I like to hear that. Kids walking down the street. If I hear their little flutes, their little toots, I know that that was me. At Walmart, I also found this like variety pack. There are some bats down here, some witch fingers, um, yo-yos. I love yo-yos. And more of these little noise makers. So I, I completely forgot there was more of them. So I will definitely be keeping one of those things to make my own noise and drive everyone insane. And this pack was actually really cheap. For 50 pieces, it's like $5. $5 for 50 pieces. That's awesome. Next we have like little bat rings, just like typical stuff that you would see in treat bags. Super cute. 98 cents. Very cheap. How many pieces are in here? 50 pieces in here as well. Adorable. I don't know. I really like the idea of giving out all this stuff to trick-or-treaters because I this is stuff I like to get when I went trick-or-treating. I loved getting all the rings, all the pencils. That was my jam. The rings and pencils were my jam. Next are these little skeletons. I don't think they're bookmarks. That would have been cool. I think they're supposed to be used for um, necklaces because there's a little like topper on their head to wear them as a necklace. And I really like this bright teal and this purple one in the back. And this is also 98 cents and 12 of them come in here. And that's really cute as well. <laughs> I bought some pencils because as I said pencils and rings wore my jam and they had these like 28 pack of pencils for $1.98 which I think is great. We have some Frankensteins and mummies and then we have what is that a little kitty cat with bats some more Frankies. I know it's Frankenstein's monster but we all call him Frankenstein and Frankie get over it. Um, and then there's like this little confetti one <laughs> that's at the end. It ran over this little confetti one at the end. And I love that the erasers are all different kinds of colors as well. And then the other pack we have is this purple one with spider webs, this little green ghosty with some bats, this little jack-o'-lantern pencils, and this little witch with some spider webs. Oh my gosh, is she the witch from the treat bag? She is! This is the same witch! Look at that. See her face there? And then see her face here. It's... you can't see that. It's the same witch. That's cute. I love cohesiveness. Yes! And the other pencils we got were 12, I think. Yeah, 12 in a pack for 98 cents. And the reason I got these because they were different designs. And we couldn't decide which ones to get, so we just got both designs. And these have a little Dracula and then there's a little skeleton guy and a pumpkin 
And then this one is that same cute little witch, spider webs, and candy. I might keep like one of each. I feel like that's cheating and like, I don't know. Like I'm taking away from the trick-or-treaters, but I just, I love this stuff too. So for $1.98 for 24 pieces, I found these little, they're called spiky balls, and I love them. I don't know why, I just do. And if I love them, I feel like the kitties would love them as well. And I am definitely going to keep one of these. Even my mom said she's going to keep one of these. They're so cute. I love the colors that they have this year, like this teal. That's a beautiful color. Like, I never would have thought of that for Halloween. But, um, I'm also doing, like, more toys because I want to be part of the Teal Pumpkin Project. So I'm going to have some treat bags with just toys in them for kids who have allergies. If you don't know about Teal Pumpkin, it's about giving out treats that don't have any food at all because some kids can't have any sweets at all. They could be allergic to just sweets in general. It doesn't even have to be a specific thing. So to not make kids left out on Halloween, you give out bags that have like little toys in them. And I think that's awesome. Up next are classic vampire things. Those are awesome. They've always, okay, they always hurt my teeth. I, or my gums, I guess. I like the idea of vampire teeth. These look smaller, so maybe they won't hurt my mouth, but they always hurt like the top of my gum and like the bottom. I don't know. I like the idea of these, but every time I put them on, I always regret it. And these are 98 cents for 12. Another thing that I bought, this one was at Target, are these skull erasers that I thought were really neat and I am definitely going to keep one. I'm going to open one right now, actually. And these were $3 for 24 in here, which, I mean, I think they're kind of pricey still, but I thought it was kind of worth it because it's a giant eraser. They're not like the itty bitty erasers. They're a good size skull eraser. Look how cute that is. I love that. Yes. Last but not least, going back to Walmart, we found for the house this adorable skull soap. It is really neat. I love this so much. I don't even know what it smells like. Let me smell it. Ooh. Ooh. That's like cinnamon. It has a spice to it. Not pumpkin spice. I don't watch it says pumpkin spice jack-o-lantern scented this is what a jack-o-lantern smells like maybe it is pumpkin spice then if it's jack-o-lantern scented um refillable dispenser really all soap dispensers are refillable but it's in the shape of a skull that's neat <laughs> this is not food that's what it says i mean like i get it that's helpful but it's just kind of funny at the same time I like how it also teaches you how to wash your hands. I mean, I get it, it's for like kids, but parents should already teach their children how to wash their hands. I don't know, I just think that's kind of funny. Okay, so maybe that's what it is. It's supposed to be like pumpkin spice, because it smells like cinnamon. And there we have it. That's it for today's Vlogoween. All of the goodies, all of the wonderful treats. There will be another video of me putting it all together. That'll be closer to Halloween, so that's gonna have some patience on all of us, especially me. I like to do things way ahead of time because I just get so excited. Who knows, I might do it sooner because I just can't contain myself. So there'll be another video of us putting the treat bags together, bonding. Thank you so much for watching today's video. If you liked today's video, you can subscribe down below. If you'd like to follow me on my other social media, they are also linked down below. And I will see you guys tomorrow for the next one. Bye!